um, Merry Belated Christmas, because <laughs> I know this vlog is gonna go up after Christmas because I am going to be filming my entire week of Christmas. And sadly, I have a very busy week and not the kind of fun busy where it's social plans and being all jolly. I am working this week, hardcore. So um, it is Sunday, the, so it is the weekend before Christmas. I am filming this on Sunday, the 22nd, but I looked at the clock and it's past midnight. So now it is Monday, the 23rd. And I have to be up really early because I have an eight to five shift in downtown Dallas. And in order to make it there on time and not have to deal with the road rage in the morning, I'm gonna have to leave the house around seven. It's quite the drive for me. Uh, but I have gotten ready in various ways. The last thing I have to do is wrap my mom's Christmas present because she will come home tomorrow and I would like for her to be pleasantly surprised when she looks under the tree. As you can see, I think pretty much most of the gifts that will be unwrapped are here, uh, but we probably have a few more to add. But again, like why am I talking about this? This isn't like a fun vlog for me. <laughs> like this is, this is serious guys. So I decided, you know what, if I am going to have a stressful work week doing this and that, I'm gonna bring you guys with me so I feel a little less alone. Okay. Oh, hey. I, okay, I have, have a tendency to like snooze the alarm a lot. So for all I know, I'm not gonna have time in the morning to actually show you. So I wanted to show you now that I have kind of been starting to pick out some outfits not this <laughs> I, i'm not wearing a swimsuit um i guess i feel kind of weird you guys seeing my bra but i actually showed this off in a haul video it's from victoria's secret pink and let's face it every girl has to wear a bra so i was thinking this turtleneck sweater you'll get a better view once i have it on and this will be tomorrow on monday and i have these cute little earrings now um for the shoes I was thinking I'm just going to wear my high-heeled Converse. I don't know. I feel like those are fine because it's kind of a smart, casual look. And then for, um, I'm not going to go digging through there, but I have a new top that I'm going to wear when I work Christmas Eve, which is a half day. Uh, then um, the day after Christmas, I think it would be cool if I was kind of a little bit more casual. And then this is just a tank top because the main top that I'll be wearing is this one. It's long sleeve and because that's brown, I can then wear my brown boots. These are the most comfortable when you're working with heavy inventory, but you know, black and brown can make a frown. So I got to do those black ones with this outfit. And then let me show you what is going on in here. Not over there. Whoa, not over there. That's too much to go through, but in here. Um, so I've been packing this and you've seen this before. I can't remember when the last time, but I, I brought this as well to the interview and to training and it works perfectly. Um, so let me give you like a little bag tour. So in here, there's secret pockets. I have an umbrella and then I don't think I have, I have the bag strap in here. Let me close those back up. And then I have like a mini zippered pocket that I kind of treat like my purse items, kind of like my money and chargers and whatnot. And then we have my 2019 planner, because it's still 2019. This I had brought before because it's just extra paper in here to take notes, even though I do also bring my laptop. And then here, kind of been manhandling it. I hope it still looks pretty for the camera. I, okay, I don't need this like being a total peep show the entire time. Okay, so this was on my Christmas wish list. And I had got to pick it out, which I kind of appreciate. <laughs> and I went to half price books because they're always pretty well priced and we had some books to cash in. So ultimately I got this for free, but half price books is a place you easily forget about, but they have board games and planners and some toys and calendars and really, really pretty stationary. This year I wasn't too impressed with their planners, uh, but last year I was like, I got, 
this under ten dollars i believe this was 5.99 this planner it's a little bit stained but it's perfect because i really wanted something that would lay flat and then have um the main monthly calendars all together and that's what this is it's just all monthly calendars this one has more of an agenda let me go through it so um this is what i'm talking about like i like having this to just really look at my entire month this is how i'm the most visual i wish these were a bit bigger but at least i can be happy that because of the ring binder it does lay flat i didn't want rings though i get kind of nervous that you can manhandle them and mess them up um, the tabs are very helpful so that'll make it easy for me to flip to what i need um, now something different that this has that i know a lot usually do is now I have a breakdown of each day, but I've been wanting to be better about plan. Oh my gosh, National National Taco Day! Okay, but I've been wanting to be better at planning out my to do list and especially like my upload schedule. I have that on my computer, but it would be nice to have this here for on the go. Basically, that's all that I have to show you. But it is time for me to brush my teeth and go to bed, and I will talk to you guys in the morning. Good morning. <laughs> so I have been up for about 30 minutes. It, the clock now reads 6.20 a.m. I did hit snooze a bit, but that's why I don't like sound that froggy like. You know how like you get like a croak in your throat <laughs> when you first wake up. So my morning voice is starting to go away. Um, so I tried to upload a video while I slept and it looks like it has a little over another hour to go, but I'm gonna have to leave here sooner than that. So I don't know, it kind of bums me out. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to let it finish. Maybe it telling me that it has an hour and 11 minutes. Sorry, that's what I'm looking at, like the load screen. Maybe it'll be more just like an hour. Oh, but if it's an hour, I leave the house at 7.50, maybe, I don't know. Okay, so I gotta go eat and then get ready before I can check back in, because I wanna show you guys my outfit. But um, wow, like I really figured like I'm in such a bad habit of going to bed at two in the morning. So I slept in yesterday, like really slept in, knowing I would go to bed at two in the morning. And I got under four hours of sleep and wow, I was kind of miserable this morning. That was not a good plan. So, okay. Oh gosh, I'm always yawning. Uh oh, wait. I used like an eyebrow wax to calm this down. Ooh. Why? Okay, let's see. I have to leave in about 15 minutes at the latest. And it's 35 minutes to go. I'm still gonna try my best to see. It's, like, that's not really that accurate. It's going down faster than that, but okay. Come on. What's going on? Maybe. You know what? Sometimes you just gotta deal with things during the day. And that's gonna be one of the things I'll deal with constantly during the day. Rawr! So, uh, yes, I am still on time with getting ready. I did need to test this swimsuit. It's a bit hard because of like my boob type and being very petite and the fact that like my chest bone kind of, this is kind of weird, but like, I guess while I was developing, it was slightly angled. And that's really hard when I wear like anything with a plunging neckline because I just have the illusion of being a, a lot bonier. So, but like I can still play around with this and you know what, like maybe if I just ate a little bit more, I could just get a little bit more boobage and I'll be good. So um, overall, I like the swimsuit, it's very strappy, uh, but I got to do a little bit of filming with it and then I'll throw on those clothes. <laughs> I mean, I had time to do this, okay? <laughs>
around in the swimsuit, but it was cute. Okay, I'm just only a few minutes late and I'd be like late for being early, so I think we're good. But here is my outfit. Didn't have time to mess with those other earrings. I just put these on, which are simple. And I brought some lip gloss that has a little bit more pigment that I'll apply once the workday actually starts. But here we go. This legit breaks my heart. 96% 13 minutes, but I can't wait that long. Oh, I'm, I am so sad. Okay. I'm just gonna have to X out of this. There's no way I can pick it back up. Oh, yes, leave. Oh, oh, there was an emergency. My car was so frosty and it was such like hard ice, which was weird because it still looked pretty thin. I had to use so much elbow grease like again and again, finally on the road. Oh, my tan looks pretty good. I was nervous because I think I applied my face tanner wrong or it's because like I put like a serum on afterward. I thought it kind of made it blotchy. No, it's pretty good. Um, no, no time <laughs> to fix it. So it looks like I will still be getting there about five or ten minutes early. That's good enough for me. Um, but now I'm on the road and it doesn't seem like there's too much traffic and at 730 that should pick up more already So it must be because it's Christmas week. Yes, so exciting. Okay um, It's gonna be green soon when I gotta go. Wow, there was like no traffic So I'm about 13 minutes early still have to like get out and go down the elevator but I was very happy about that. So then that means tomorrow should be even easier traffic wise um, Now just kind of like the same rules apply I think you guys understand like the common sense part of this um, I'm going to a job so I won't really be able to vlog much if any I don't I don't know so sorry guys if you guys don't get like a lot of footage of today I'm off this morning it went really well and I felt very much on fire, like I remembered everything that was in training. And so now I'm all set up, I'm off to lunch, and we're going to go see Austin Tino. And he introduced me to this restaurant called Roti. It's Mediterranean, and they opened a new one up. I'm sorry, I'm tired, that's within walking distance. And he's so nice, because he walked to the original Roti, <laughs> and now he's doing a beeline to this Roti. Cause he knows like I don't know how like my way around downtown yet. I almost got one of those lime scooters. I downloaded the app, but before I put my credit card in, I kind of wanted to research the rates and understand that better. Done with my work shift. Sorry, it's so dark. I'll just keep this short. Um, I was running off of less than four hours of sleep and I did pretty well. I did have a latte at one point, but I mean, that was just being smart because I'm gonna like try to be a little bit productive when I get home. We shall see. <laughs> I still have a lot to do YouTube wise and I don't want this cute outfit and makeup to go to waste. But right now I see it as twilight. I hope traffic's okay. I'm back home. I'm tired. <laughs> I am trying to stay up though and alert because I think as soon as I lie down, I'm just gonna crash. So I am trying again to re-upload my video and I'm not stopping until it works. Um, I do want to film and do this and that, but I probably should prioritize cleaning a bit before I go on and do that. And I don't even think there's anything for dinner. I'm gonna have to go find dinner. <laughs> so I can't fall asleep, I really can't. Merry Christmas Eve. So I'm taking care of some pups. But I gave them all each a bone 
And Bella, she's just a little delicate flower, so she's not hungry right away. But her meal has the best because it's two big spoonfuls of this like homemade, like gourmet style food. Come on, Bella. I got to go. I, I'm just gonna feel bad because it's one of those foods that's so tasty and better than the other dogs get that I can totally see them sneaking her food. Oh, she took a bite. We're good, we're good, okay. Better laugh, ooh, ooh. But you can't blame me for trying. You know I'm a lion said, who in the world? Ooh, ooh. Oh, so heavy. I got like all my goodies. Okay, let me press the number that I wanna go to. Elevator B. I know, just too fancy for me. <laughs> it's nice because nobody's here, so I don't have to be embarrassed by vlogging. Okay. Well, I got here early so I can prepare. So I'm gonna have to put you guys down because I wanna have a good, set up a nice little breakfast for everybody. I wonder what breakfast is. It might be bagels. I can only be trusted with bagels. Yes, I should have vlogged when I was in better lighting, but I'm done. And I posted a really cute Instagram photo. So, okay. I am now buzzed on cold brew. I kind of have to go to the bathroom, but I'm just gonna venture out anyway. Yeah, I think I'm okay. <laughs> we'll see. Okay, ended up doing a quick stop at Walmart because me madre asked me to. So I may have picked up like a breakfast yogurt, <laughs> not a breakfast, a dessert yogurt, <laughs> which is one of those Yo Crunch ones with the M&Ms. So I did just got done doing the dogs. I didn't really vlog it because I was on a time crunch. Um, so I got to get home. You ready? There we go. I got you. I got you, Luna. Hmm. I'm trying different methods to get Bella to eat. Yes, Bella. Bella's a bit older. The other dogs have eaten. It took Bella a bit though, because you gotta wake her up. But I know she sees the food. Oh, Bella. I just get nervous because I know sometimes the dogs forget and they get hungry. And then I don't want them eating Bella's, but I have to go to work. It's hard being a dog mom. Um. Yeah, I can see out of my windows, which is good. It was just, everything was so much water and condensation. Um, so I'm sorry. Wait, why are they still going? No. Okay, they stopped. Sorry, I have my windshield wipers going. Um, so I didn't film Christmas. Sorry, I just, I don't know. It was just kind of nice to not film. Uh, but it was a really good Christmas, and you guys will see more about that because of course, I'm gonna do a haul video of what I got for Christmas. That'll go on my main channel um, probably before this vlog. But go check it out. Uh, but yeah, so I don't really have much to report on. It was a good Christmas. I mean, it's, it's exactly how you can visualize it. People must be here, but at the same time, I don't want them to hear me like talking to you guys. I'm gonna prop you up so I can give you like the full outfit. This dog is crazy for treats. You know, just me and Luna hanging out. Bella almost joined us. Oh, she kind of likes her little island ottoman over there. That's okay. Come on, Bella. If you hear some munching, Corbett is still working on his little rawhide bone. He wasn't that good at eating it. It was weird. Everybody else knew to chew it like this. Then I'd look at him and be like, ah. 
<laughs> It'd be like going up his throat. It was funny. I didn't vlog much at work. I was tired. It was a slow day. Um, sorry. Sorry, sorry. I like dogs when they're not up in your face licking you. I mean, I, I guess I don't really mind it, but I want to film later, so I kind of need, like, a little bit of my makeup still on. <laughs> yes, you've got to do that. Oh, oh, he. Man, look. I like playing with their ears. I keep going inside out. Good morning. I'm putting my shoes on right now. I should probably just sit down and do them. I felt like I didn't talk to you guys much yesterday. I was so tired. I went over, hung out with the doggies, napped with them, because I figured the whole point was for me to just kind of be with them. And then they all got up on the couch and hung out with me while I napped. Uh, so I still got to see them this morning. I hope Bella's hungry. I know it's kind of early for her, especially when she just wakes up. Like I get it when I first wake up, I don't want to eat. Um, but yeah, I, I snoozed the alarm hardcore. I'm still so tired. Wow, I think it's because it's cloudy, it's dark. Usually I'm talking to you guys on my way to work. It's pretty bright out. And I'm like living for the lighting, but now not so much. Um, so I see there's some traffic, it's not too bad. But I have a feeling a lot of people who took the week off still feel like they need to sneak into the office for at least some hours today, being the Friday, because we're about to hit New Year's. I get it. So I am anticipating more people to cater to today. Um, that's fine with me. I think we're doing a double breakfast. So usually it's just been bagels or it's, you know, maybe it's this or that. They've, they keep giving me bagels because they know that's easy for me to set up. This time it's breakfast and leftover bagels. So it's gonna be like a really big spread. And I did a little happy hour yesterday. I kind of want to do it again, just cause it's a holiday week. Why not have it twice in a row? I think I'll be offering them the same options. So one was like eggnog, um, just to have like a sweeter trend. Like even Bailey's I read, which made it super sweet, which I loved, had that. And then of course just the classic vodka, a cranberry drink people can make mixers some people aren't down for that or just do the straight vodka <laughs> so now I gotta scope out to see how many coffee pots to brew usually they do two full ones but this week I've only needed to do one but I want to be prepared okay so I am by myself again today but I won't be tomorrow and that'll be a normal busy work week I'm assuming so it's really important that I like get all the bases covered, making it look good, all that. Like it's always looked good, but I mean, any like side projects of organization, making sure everything is stocked, like to the fullest and just ready to go. That's what I need. a mega breakfast usually on Friday they have breakfast tacos and let's face it breakfast tacos are bomb like I don't even love <laughs> breakfast tacos that much but that's such a nice treat you know so this time was you know we had some leftover bagels I know not as fun because <laughs> they had a lot of bagels this week uh, but then I also had um, the juices out and then cereal but now the caddy's pretty good because I have to restock some conference rooms and office and I organized it. Look how cute it looks. But I want to find the bigger post-it so I'm trying to look. Probably be more beneficial if I put you guys down. But I'm in the office section but all I see is more like cleaning bathroom supplies. I think I'm going to have to rummage. Good morning. I realized that I need to close out this vlog. I felt like I kind of became worse and worse at filming. Just, I started getting tired and distracted and things came up. Uh, but both of my jobs of doing the cute doggies and working downtown is done. But now I'm back here in downtown. So I am meeting Samantha and Emmy Tom at Hyde over on Elm Street. Apparently something about their, they're wanting to see their Christmas decorations. I've never been, so I'm like, okay, whatever. But it's just funny because now it's a Saturday and I'm back in downtown. Um, I look a bit rough. 
like my eyebrows need done. I don't know why I need to like show you guys this. I have like minimal makeup on, which is fine, but like when you're looking rough, you realize you need a little more. Like my hair is not great. I have a headband. This, I've had this since high school. <laughs> I need to make certain changes with my wardrobe. Um, but, okay, so I think I showed you guys this in a previous vlog. I got some jewelry and I purposely got some grab bags because Emmy Tom had relocated herself with the apartment. <laughs> that was a fancy way of saying it. Anyway, she was having a new apartment warming party. And I was gonna go and I was gonna show off the swag bags. And, um, not swag bags, but they're like mystery bags for them to check out. And now I'm doing it because I didn't get to go last time. <laughs> I ended up canceling. Um, just a lot of stuff happened. Like we were smelling natural gas and we had to evacuate our house, this and that. So yeah, I was not in the mood and my hair was still wet because we evacuated mid shower. So that was a hard time for me. So now I am ready. I think they found parking because my phone is now blowing up. So I'm gonna go make my way in and socialize with the goodies so thank you guys so much for watching i sometimes don't always know what i'm doing with my live channel but just whenever i think of filming i want to film and keep you guys in the loop with my day to day so but if you guys have like a direction that you want to see with how these vlogs go let me know down below so, okay.